three new boys. I'm a VTuber. Nice to see you. Uh, hi. If if you like, you could subscribe and like. I don't know. Uh, hi. <laughs> So yeah, uh, so since uh, you know I did the once before of Yukat's uh, videos about crop guides of Final Fantasy fourteen. This time he played to the ranch DPS and who knows? Oh yeah, I will not going to to react to it because you know I've been playing F fourteen like more than a thousand hours, like only thousand hours only on Steam without counting the ones of PS four because I used to have no PC I played on a PS four. Uh, yeah, my, my PC died because I'm F14 and I have to live with it as well. Uh, let's go with this. Um, okay, let's go. Quick announcement, I'm partnering with Gamersups. If you want to try out some tasty energy oh. drink flavors, you can get some free samples and they even ship worldwide. If you like it and want more, use the code JOKAT for 10% off. Oh, nice. Turn around. Every now and then I get a little bit tired of being counted on to do complex tasks that involve more than it takes to eat a bowl of mushy cereal. In fact, I don't even feel... What the... They say, hey, can you please use Peloton? <laughs> I'm motivated to hear what my allies need of me. I'm just going to sit all the way over oh. here, enjoying my lucky charms. Yeah. Alone. And if things go oh. wrong, I'll have to rely on the ever-reliable American method. I already see absolutely no negative consequences. Well, he's, he's talking about guns, right? Okay. To Final Fantasy. I am Octomoric and I am Spanish. <laughs> I'm sick of having to dodge so many up close AoEs. The boss is <laughs> doing them and I have to keep moving away to avoid getting splatted. And then I have to resort to the equivalent of throwing marshmallows that will scratch the enemy about as hard as a massage therapist with germophobia. I'm trying to beat them into submission. <laughs> you know, that's actually true. The the melee track, like the melee the melee jobs uh, have shitty shitty attacks when they go range. So yeah, if you want to keep attacking, even if you go out of your melee range, it's going to be yeah, uh, squishy marshmallows, useless. Like, okay, they're going to add to DPS, but they are going to be like nightmares. Should not soften their tenders. What's that I hear you say? There's an option to give me the ability to do max deets even when I'm disconnected from the boss like an <laughs> internet provider out in the country? What? Of course there is. I was just getting to it and I'll thank you not to interrupt me again. The physical range oh, DPS, or just range for short. Physically throwing my spleen into the splattering range. Okay, let's read what it says. Okay, let's go hop to it. Okay, hop to it, hop to it. Uh, range, physical range DPS. What if a stop but far away? Mandatory fussy heart, mandatory legs, speed, supporting disguise, coolest limit breaks animations, don't mention me. <laughs> yeah. Change of the near semi for long is the more mobile and forgiving cousin of the melee and is the most important person in the party since you are the least likely to get a commission <laughs> in the end. And we thank you for providing such a valiant service as there always needs to be someone in last place. Your role is all about uh, keeping your uptime going. And although, yes, every other role is also about trying to do that, you have absolutely no excuse for messing up. The gimmick of the ranged DPS is that you don't have to worry about any positionals or calf times and can run around the arena like an indecisive artist in a Hobby Lobby. You get to stay at a safe distance and if there's ever a pissy <laughs> puddle underneath your feet moving out of the way won't risk you doing suboptimal damage. So what's the catch? Nobody gets off scot-free in this game as all roles. I mean, it's a fucking uh, wrench DPS that are like physical. Don't have fucking cost times. I I have played like Danza, uh, Machinist a bit because Machinist is level 60 so to 70. But, uh, but my main is Danza right now with those. And let's be honest. You don't have to even think that you have even more mobility skills. Oh yeah, I can jump three times. Oh yeah, I can jump backwards. In any case, I am too close to melee. Oh yeah, I can fucking shoot you a fucking real, or some have something attacking you at melee range while I am moving away. What the fuck is going on with range? It's like really nice, but people actually don't appreciate them. Because but is a good repeat. It's a good uh, what you say it. Mm, it's a good support. Dancer is a good support. Machinist is a good gun. That's all. I don't just just have the room. <laughs> okay. Roles have their stonks and stinks. Tanks have the responsibility. Wait, wait, wait. What the say? Free in this game, as all roles have their stonks. Fashion HP for days. Good. 
Gott wird hart stehen. Also. Since Stink tanks have the responsibility of dancing with the boss, healers have to share gear models with the magic DPS that have been dyed white, and you will have to suffer the nail pulling drawback known as the range tax. To balance for the fact that you have nearly no limitations on your mobility, your damage will be on average slightly less than both the melee oh. and the DPS jobs. And hell, sometimes even some tanks with their openers that'll put down bosses faster than Peter when it finds a stray. The range tax, although real, will make a tiny droplet of difference in the grand scheme of things. Mm. And if you pick a range job and feel as though you're being outdone by your peers, odds are you were probably doing badly anyway and the reason you have people <laughs> jumping over that hurdle was just because your toes were too big and floppy that you would have tripped over every single one so badly anyway discovery channel would decide to make a show about whether or not you're real let me summarize if you do bad it's a skill issue nevertheless oh. the same rules as any rule applies and the fact that you should stay out of the piss puddles wherever possible even more so considering you're wearing heelys and by all rights should be able to avoid any and every possible puddle and be the nicest smelling at the party which is important because the healers only have so much nasal tolerance <laughs> <laughs> only had so much nasal <laughs> yeah tolerance lucky for you each range also has a bottle of perfume to spray that will let yeah each one has there at least mask the piss smell a bit the final shared utility in the belt of the black man is the limit break which although does not do as much single target damage as the melee has the benefit of being able to hit multiple targets in a line like a really violent high five surfer the range oh. is a trio of performers each one skilled in a different charismatic art and each one a different flavor of slutty first is the bow <laughs> where your bow is your harp also your harp is your harp because with this job you get a bunch of instruments you can play including yeah. these obnoxiously loud drums you are one of the few jobs <laughs> with the endangered species known as the damage over time skill and your main attack involves Involves firing a single arrow repeatedly until a bigger oh. cool arrow gets jealous and sometimes asks to be fired too. But not all the time. Yeah. It's not like it likes to be shot or anything. You also have a bunch of songs to play. Yeah, guys, do you remember that in the stream I actually finished the level, <laughs> level 70 of, of, of part? Uh, 70, sorry, 70 of part. And I got that skill, like the, the fancy one. That will make everyone in the party hear a remix of their opening theme. And everybody knows when the opening kicks on, you deal more damage. Because you're the one playing them, you also get your own special benefits, you filthy, dirty performer, you. A song that sometimes lets you shoot more arrows when it feels like giving you some. A song that makes you shoot faster. Mm. And a song that lets you shoot more arrows when it feels like giving you some. But a little bit different. All this arpeggios to a crescendo into a grand finale where you fire a big ol' arrow. And if you've played all your songs, you have the oh. ability to face roll your piano and startle your party into doing even more damage. I said hit harder! Now hold on to those notes. <laughs> <laughs> For the machinist's main attack, it uses a gun. The most selfish of the range classes, where the name of the game is and the name because of the box called your doom being beeps. shipped to the enemy at terminal velocity. Yeah. What you sacrifice in party buffs you make up for in big <laughs> having three giant bullets and a bunch of smaller, higher frequency bullets. Doing your normal one, two, three will get your gun very hot and bothered until it's riled up enough to rapid fire its red hot goodness. Oh. You toss your special toy into the mix, it can end in an explosive. Yes, yes, yes. Give up that momentum, and eventually you can even invite your queen to join in the fun. Hey, I yeah. Think she's got multiple frequency settings. <laughs> <laughs> as much but no need to be nervous lucky for you this job comes with extra protection but you yeah. are not some simpleton who can be won over by some flashy lights and pretty songs mm -hmm. you want passion romance, <laughs> a partner who can live up to your standards the damage no. foregoes buffing the entire party or focusing on doing zone damage and instead picks one party member one extra oh. special extra spicy extra sexy partner in crime to give a super buff in damage yeah two extra flashy minigames of simon says and then you do a little bit of blending and sending the body Flying their dying birdies that give them birdies. And after from there, it's all coin flips all the time. Your rotation is a one and a two that can coin flip into a three and a four. And both of those can coin flip into either a single target or AoE five, which itself is a coin flip into a possible six. Then once you're in rhythm, your spit knees will kill them. Then dance in the wind like that Marian ribbons and kicking and flipping their carrions into your allies so they can annihilate all that's left. Yay, now they're dead. And now you know how to play ranged. You're welcome. What the fuck is going on? He actually made another banger song. He says he is in uh, Mao Paya Franco song, which is uh, the Spanish song. Haha, <laughs> it's a Spanish song of ever Final Fantasy. Oh, yeah, <laughs> but Spanita, my beloved. I'm, I'm from Spain, okay? Um, I'm Spanish, <laughs> but oh my god. Oh my god, it's... I have to say, I didn't expect so many gun memes. I mean, I will expect more. At least some of them are, like, they're not insensitive. I was thinking, oh yeah, they're going to be insensitive in one way. They're not, at least. I was, I was hoping, like, they would have to say something weird. 
Like, this is the reference to an artist that is in Chichua. That is the about white mages and I'm happy. I don't remember her name, but you know. Has he held in ho? Let's be honest. I bet this three. I have played. Uh, when I started the game, uh, first time I started the game, I chose Bart. I chose Bart because, you know, I like go ranch. And that was the only ranch where, like, you could go in F14 in the beginning because I used to play back in the beginning in the Iron River. That's what I wanted. I wanted to go with an ar 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 shooting arrows and saying, oh, yeah, uh, big fuck damage probably. No, it's shitty damage. But uh, they have upgraded a lot the ranch DPS over the Bard because the Bard used to have casting. Don't you know that? <laughs> I remember that people told me that Bard used to have casting and it was an item. And now it's like, yeah, it was not too different from Black Mage or anything like that. This Black Mage has more big damage. Now it doesn't have cast time. Now it's like, oh yeah, the only cast has time is when you shoot the arrow, but it doesn't matter because you can still move. And it's not like, oh yeah, uh, you move a little in Black Mage. Yeah, go to hell, it's going to go away. There's like, that's the difference now. Now, Bard is more mobile, uh, our mobility, about being being able to attack without having to delay yourself, which is better because it used to have casting. Um, gone. <laughs> Machinist. Machinist is actually every every single time is good at making damage in even DPS, like even in DPS, PvP, PV, uh, dry, like anything. It, and they make backflicks when they attack. Like, oh my god. Who fucking do fuck that's black facing when they attack? I don't know. They are fucking amazing. I have played Machinist for a while. I don't, I don't, I don't know, understand many. The storyline is like, yeah. Stupid, uh, it's guardians that know that guns are better than the swords because you know, don't give me a knife in a gunfight. Um, and then we have uh, Danza. Danza is actually the one I got to level 80, like all focusing because only the, the armors, the, the clothes, the clothes of, of the Danza actually are really nice. Like, I will say to you, the clothes of a Danza is like mwah, cream de la creme. Like, no joke, um, for example, I will say that uh, this video is really accurate in that case that, okay, you want to learn a simple way to learn this, this range DPS, it's true that, yeah, uh, they don't have any problems about DPS exactly, unless if you die as a range DPS, it's your own fault. Or uh, is the healer's fault if they haven't healed you like for a long while and they have done quite a number of AoEs. Well, usually they have to heal after a big AoE damage. So it's not your fault. It's not their fault. It's your fault if you die. Trust me. Trust me. I'm a bloody fucking healer main. I am going to murder you if you go saying, oh no, it's the healer's fault when you are a bloody hell range dps do you have mobility do you know how hard it was for healers to have mobility do you know how fucking hard that not until end Roca, many healers had mobility don't get fucking me you know how hard it's a healer to stay alive when they have like 30,000 uh, peace puzzles, but it's a uh, yo cut, and uh, you are putting them nearby him. Like, yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, I'm going to die as a healer. You have mobility, you have bloody jumps. Bart has a jump to go backwards. Oh, yeah, they're too close. Let me jump back. Oh, yeah, I'm a dancer. I can jump three times around. Dump, dump, dump. That's all. Oh, in advance. In advance is fucking bloody useful. Please use it. Like, I am going to go to murder your children if you don't go using the Naval properly. Uh, also, they, you can use it to counter uh, knockbacks, by the way. If you train them perfectly, you can knock, you can counter knockbacks and you don't have to use arm sled. Hi, nice tip. Ha. Uh, what else? Uh, yeah, uh, and Machinist, it's actually really good damage. And it's really easy, like, there's actually, the, the, the rotation of Machinist is really easy. 
please. Like, if you don't want to think, go back in it. Trust me, it's going to be worth it. I have a friend who actually learned machinists to do endgame. And actually, it was worth it because he didn't have to think about a lot about uh, of the rotation. And he was like, yeah, this thing is completely a nightmare because I don't have to think. So if I fucked up, I fucked up. It's not like, oh, yeah, I, I fucked up the rotation. No, if I fucked up, it's, it's my own fault. That's the only problem you have. It's a skill issue. Yeah. Please. It's like not that hard to evade AOEs as soon as you get them. You don't have to be greedy and be like a Melody PS who say old clothes while the attacks are happening. You can fucking move. Do that. Or your healers are going to murder you in your sleep. No joke. I am going to go with my white mate's clothes. I'm going to trick throw the stick all over your face. Move! <laughs> like... You can move! I have been like a fucking nightmare whenever I play range. I go running around because I can move without thinking. If you're black mix, okay. If you're a, like, please, up. Oh, yeah, but only thing, one thing. If you are at range, please don't stay nearby the paladin or the tank because, you know, you're going to be also damaged. If you die because you are moving too fast and moving right where the fucking cone of the tank buster is, is your own fault. Like, read it around, bitch. Please, sorry. <laughs> but it's one of the funniest uh, classes in FF14, let's be honest. I just hope that you know, cats actually keeps doing these kind of videos. But let's be honest. I love range DPS in a way that it was the first class I played in the game. I stopped because, you know, uh, being a DPS is a nightmare and I didn't like that in the end. I love it, the story. So let me tell you in a nutshell every story of the DPS so range so you know a bit about what you're missing. First is the... what you call it? Uh, first is the Bart. The Bart has a simple reason to be. Bart has two gays trying not to be gay. That's all. Um, uh, Sansan and Gaidalot, I love you. Uh, next one is Makinis. Makinis is, yeah, its guards are, are fucking stupid and don't know that you cannot throw knives in a gun fight because they believe that Sword and Shield is better than a gun. <laughs> Spoiler right? No. Um, then we have Danza, it's Kepia Trupe. And it's scalping around and doing, yeah, no, crazy shit. Like, you just go dancing all over the world. You do belly dancing. <laughs> and then you say, oh, yeah, let's dance forever together because you're my girlfriend, girl that gives me the quest. That's all. Yeah. That's all three stories. That's better. Uh, to be honest, I would recommend the three. Especially if you want to know about lore, uh, about lore, it's better go. Uh, lore of Didania, you go with Bart. If you want to learn about the Didania lore, about especially a lesson lore, then you have uh, what you call it? Uh, yeah, and Machinis is more Guardian lore, with love means and a bit, but it's more Guardian to be honest. Um, because you know you can find it in Scar. <laughs> And the dancer is more Tharnarian lore. Tharnarian lore and a bit of everywhere else. Like, you know, it's going to tell you about Tharnar, about the dancer press, about, to, about what works, anything like that. So it's worth it. Okay? Okay. Bye. So that's all for today. Bye. Adiosito. Take care. And please like and subscribe. Uh, I will not stream for 14 for a while because I don't have stuff, so thank you anyway. Bye! Adiosito!